Hello everyone, welcome to Fit Tip Friday. So today I've got something called the Hindu Complex for you. So essentially this consists of two exercises. We've got Hindu squats and we've got a Hindu press up. Now putting these two exercises together, you're going to get a full body workout. The squats, the benefits of the squats are you're going to work on your calves, your quads, your core and balance. The benefits of doing a Hindu press up are you're going to work on your flexibility and strength in the upper body and the thoracic region of the spine. And you're also going to uh, work on engaging your core and again stretching out the lower limbs, your calf area. The benefits of these two exercises are you can do them anywhere. You don't need that much room at all to do them. So you don't need any equipment, you don't need much room to do them. So they're just two ideal exercises to have in your armory that you can combine and utilize anytime you wish when you haven't got any equipment available. Uh, well, as we're getting back to the new normal, potentially if you're traveling on business where they do open up hotels, you can do it in a hotel room. If you're away for a, a short break abroad and you haven't got access to a gym, you could utilize these exercises either outdoors in some open space or even indoors in your hotel room. So they really are very versatile exercises to have in your armory. So I'm going to demonstrate both the exercises first, then I'm going to go and do a demonstration round of 10 repetitions of each. So the first exercise we're going to go for is a Hindu squat. So it's different to a traditional squat in that you actually start up on your toes, okay? Arms out to the front. You're actually going to breathe out on the way down and you're going to place your hands slightly behind you. Stay on your toes as you go down with all the pressure on your quads. So hands shoot down behind you. Stay on your toes. And as you come back up, you bring your hands back up in front. Okay? So breathe out on the way down. Breathe in the way up. Out on the way down, in on the way up. And it's actually easier if you actually speed up the motion, you'll get more of a cardiovascular workout. Okay, so that's a Hindu squat. Next exercise we're going to do, I'm going to show you, is obviously the Hindu press up. So, the starting position for this, get yourself into press up position to start with just to get started. Then what you're going to do is you're actually going to walk your hands back and stick your backside up in the air. So for Hindu squats, this is your actual starting position. What you're then going to do is, you're going to take your head down, you're going to swoop down with your head, bending your elbows, and then take yourself into what's known as the cobra position. Finish there. Then you bring it back, backside up in the air, Forward, so you can see it. Take it down and up, then take it back. Down and up, then take it back. One more time, you see now how to do it. Down, up, and back. Okay, so. The demonstration I'm going to do for you now is 10 repetitions of the squats straight into 10 repetitions of the Hindu press ups. So, for beginners, you will be looking to do two rounds, intermediate, three rounds, advanced, you take up to five rounds of these 10 reps of each exercise. Again, I'll put that there on the screen for you so you know how many rounds you're going to do of each exercise. And again, on the screen, up above on Facebook and below, on YouTube, I will have a description of the repetitions for each exercise as well. So, 10 Hindu squats to start with, straight into 10 Hindu press-ups. And this is the beginner's one round option, okay? Up on your toes, off we go. Let's get 
10 squats, press up position, walk it back, 10 press ups. So there we go, Fit Tip Friday, two fantastic exercises, it's going to work your body all over, work on several fitness components, it's just going to work on strength, flexibility and obviously cardiovascular fitness components. So 10 Hindu squats, 10 Hindu press ups, okay, 10 reps each. And then the beginners rounds, it's going to be one round for beginners, sorry, two rounds for beginners, three rounds for intermediates, five rounds for advance. As always, any questions, you need to ask me questions, you want any tips or hints, just email me please, engage. Or even put a thumbs up on Facebook or pin me a message in the comments please, yeah? Enjoy your weekend, enjoy the weather. Good luck, stay safe, and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye.